Fairhope High School track and cross country athletes have a new place to compete closer to campus. A dedication ceremony today for a new track at Founders Park. And as WKRG News 5's Blake Brown explained, students now have a track that meets state requirements. Yeah, this won't be the last track built in Baldwin County. In fact, this is just the beginning. These high school athletes have a new place to run after years of using an old track at Volanta Park. That track is concrete, so we could not wear our typical spikes, our racing shoes, while we ran, and it was a very cramped. All of the lanes were spray painted on, so it was a very different feel. The Baldwin County Public School System and the City of Fairhope cutting the ribbon on a joint project at Founders Park just behind Fairhope High School Tuesday, giving these students a chance to compete closer to campus on a track that now meets state requirements. It gives those kids the opportunity to be able to train in a facility like this and for us to be able to host, you know, Alabama High School Athletic Association meets. We haven't been able to do that in Fairhope and so excited about being able to do it. Superintendent Eddie Tyler says the track and field programs are growing faster than ever before across the district. Now there are plans to build even more tracks like this in the county over the next couple of years. Several years ago, uh, four students from Ball County High School won the 4 by 100 relay. And they practiced on grass you know, on a football field. And so shortly after that, we decided we were going to build them a track. This is just another example of, of what we're doing. Even though Fairhope High School will utilize this track majority of the time, it's still open to the public. We have a lot of people who just run for recreation. In Fairhope, I'm Blake Brown, WKRG News 5.